on our journey to peace for a more just, sustainable, healthier, and joyful world. We must also recognize that um, harboring resentments, grievances, having the need uh, to get vengeance over a perceived uh, uh, perceived traumatic experience or a perceived injustice, all of that uh, interferes with our experience of peace. So many have said that uh, forgiveness is essential for achieving true peace. So you forgive not only because uh, you might shift in perspective, you forgive not because you think the other person deserves forgiveness, you forgive because you deserve peace. So forgiveness is a process, uh, not a one-time event. And forgiveness is a gift that we can give to ourselves. To forgive, to forgive others, we should start by acknowledging our own pain and anger. We should also try to understand the other person's perspective. Any situation can be seen from your perspective, from the perspective of the other, and from a third party perspective as well. And it is important to remember that forgiveness is not about forgetting. It is about accepting what happened in the past and moving on. Ultimately, forgiveness is an act of power. When you forgive, and you start with forgiving yourself too, because we all have consciously or unconsciously, um, you know, hurt someone um, in relationship or otherwise. So understand what uh, the great spiritual traditions say. What, uh, say a person like, uh, and Nisargatata would say, you know, he would say, the sinner and the saint are merely exchanging notes. The saint has a past, the sinner has a future, and all of us are both, because all experience is by contrast. So today, start the process of forgiveness by saying, today I shall judge nothing that occurs. Today I shall judge no one. I'm only talking about moral judgment, which is the domain of uh, cunning hypocrisy. I'm not talking about, you know, judging the weather or in the stock market or some kind of evaluation that is outside of our moral judgments. So just remember, forgiveness is the ultimate act of power and it is true power, self-power, power that comes from your soul and is not dependent on validation from others. So I hope you find this useful. Mm -hmm.